Hey, what's up? It's Hugo here. I'm here to talk to you about uh, Sile, which is an anti-theft security for your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad users. Um, I personally recently discovered, I know it has been around there since a while, uh, but I thought maybe some of you don't know this yet, and I thought it was pretty cool, so uh, I'm going to tell you a little bit more about it in this video. Uh, so to start off, once you start up the app, you have... Um, two options of setting up your account or how to use so obviously how to use is a uh, more explanation on how to use Sade and setting up your account is what you want to do uh, if you do not have an account uh, yet so once you choose to set up your account um, you got to be you have three tabs or three options login register or delete um, so obviously if you don't have an account go ahead and register because uh, it's a pretty cool uh, application and you can delete your account as well. So once you register, you don't need to activate your account through email. Uh, simply log in right away. Go on the login tab. You can log in, um, and you're good to go. So once you are logged in on Sile, uh, the first screen you'll see is the friends. You can add friends with their email uh, by pressing the plus button at the top right of the screen. And then you have the history, which is uh, the Sile log, basically. Then in the settings, uh, the first thing you'll see is profile. Here you can activate push notification. So be sure to have push notification on uh, because you do need to have it on for it to work so you can check push working status. Um, so be sure to check that out. Then you have a few general uh, toggles there. Uh, enable Sile, close SMS and passcode lock. You can also connect your account to a Google account um, which can be handy if you want to use the same login for t uh, both. Then you can set a pass lock, uh, auto lock, or prevent power off, which obviously does what it says. It prevents to power off the device, so I'll show you that in a minute. Uh, then you have purchase or extend your subscription. So again, you can extend your uh, subscription six months or one year. Uh, as I said, it's a 30-day trial, or I haven't said that, sorry. It's a 30-day trial of the Cydia or Rock or IC, all that stuff. You can get a 30-day trial, and then it's uh, $19.99 for one year. So uh, it's a little bit more cheaper than mobile me, that's for sure. Okay, so now let's go on the computer side of the of Sile, and you'll see how pretty awesome this application is. Once you're all set up and ready to go, you can go ahead and log into the Sile website in case it gets stolen. So it's simply Sile.com, and just simply log in with the account you just created on your iPhone. So for the ID, you use your email, and then for the password, obviously, you use your password you indicated while registering. Registering, register. Um, so then it's going to try and connect to your iPhone. So depending on what connection you are on, it's going to take a, amount, a certain amount of time. So if you're on 3G, it's going to take a little longer than if you're on Wi-Fi. Uh, so that's quite straightforward. And uh, the first thing you're going to see is all the status of your iPhone um, so what network it's on, signal strength, Wi-Fi, uh, battery level, if it's online or offline. Uh, and you can see on the map if you update location, it's going to find out the nearest, or I mean the latest um, location. So that's pretty cool. Uh, it might take a while again, depending on your connection. So there you go, it found the, the location. Uh, right here you can show this, obviously, because there's no street names at the moment, so I don't care if you're seeing this. Uh, and under there you have all the status of all the little features they have um, which are pretty interesting. Some, would, some are pretty interesting. So the first uh, thing you see is device status, device status, obviously lost or found, so if you lost it you just put lost and then lock or unlock. So right now my phone is um, unlocked. If I click on lock and set a little a password, so I'm going to change this obviously after the video. Um, it's going to automatically lock my iPhone right there. And the next time I want to unlock it, it's going to ask me for my password uh, or the password I just set up on the website. So I'm going to go ahead and set up my password. So 1337 it was. Um, and uh, that's for the first feature. So uh, simply setting um, a password. Uh, then you have an alarm. Uh, so I'm just going to check out what that is. Oh, no, wait. Display a message. So I'm going to go ahead and display a message. Hey there, give me my iPhone. Oops, back. Okay, 
So I say send, oh yeah, you also have the option of continuously playing the sound and vibrating at the same time, so it, may, it picks even more the attention of people. And you send the message, and boom, you get it on your phone right there. Um, so I made a little mistake there, but no problem. And uh, you can see the message view or simply close. And obviously, again, the option of continuously vibrating and making a sound is also uh, available. Then the alarm, I'm just going to enable that. Um, so you want to say alarm sound, I'm just going to say alarm and then submit. So there you go. There you go. Uh, I managed to disable the alarm after a second time, so it definitely the alarm definitely works because it doesn't go off. That's for sure. Even if I lock the device, the alarm doesn't go off. Uh, so that's a pretty good feature. Uh, you can back up uh, also your device. So that's a really interesting feature because uh, obviously you don't want to lose any of the data. Uh, restore uh, your iPhone. Forward SMS, so you just set a number here to uh, all the messages that get to your iPhone are going to automatically get forwarded to another phone uh, without him knowing, obviously. Uh, track your iPhone, so that's continuously going to track your iPhone, fully hide, silent, so you can go ahead and hide the application on your phone. Uh, recent calls, so you can view all the recent calls. Take a photo, so we're going to do that right now. Um, so I'm going to, I'm not doing anything on my iPhone, this is just going really automatic I'm not touching my iPhone in any way at the moment so apparently the picture feature is not working but I have found out why uh, it is because I'm screen recording my iPhone at the same time so it's not able but if you're not screen recording your iPhone which they're obviously not gonna happen when your iPhone gets stolen uh, you'll be able to take a picture uh, without any problems uh, then the next feature is forbid power off so obviously uh, it does what it says uh, it forbids to power off so if I enable that so it's going to wait, uh, you can wait a few seconds and it's going to say that it is enabled. So there you go, it says a little green check there. And right now I'm going to try to power off my iPhone. And we'll see what it does. And right there, try to power it off and it simply goes back to your springboard. So basically it doesn't um, power it off at all. And then remote wipe, that's just to clear all the data off your iPhone. Uh, Sign a log. Um, so you can view that too, but uh, that's not really interesting if it's the first time and stuff like that. Well, you can just set a logger, uh, or I mean, it's going to be created and stuff. But uh, nothing really interesting there. Uh, and there you can set up multiple phones on the same Silent account as well, recent messages account. So the rest is not really interesting. Maybe the purchase feature can be interesting just to show you how it is, uh, how much it is. It's 19.99, and you have a free trial on um, Rock or Cydia or stuff like that uh, free trial I think the trial is for 30 days so it's a one month free trial so you might want to check it out and uh, you can see all the main features here and you can do uh, one year is $19.99 and six months is $10.99 in dollars so uh, yep be sure to check it out I thought it was a pretty cool feature I mean it, if you think about it it's cheaper than find my iPhone from mobile me and uh, well it's a great service I mean you can see there's a lot of options and features so be sure to check it out and uh, I'll thank you for watching uh, I hope this video helped you out and uh, well, I'll see you guys later peace